boy band Five I've Convinced Little Mix feud began months before Jesse Nelson quit girl group Sean Conlon, Scott Robinson, and Richie Neville, three original remaining members of the veteran boy band Five I've, speculated that the public fallout between Little Mix and Jesse Nelson was brewing well before she quit in December last year Five I've suggested that the girl group were feuding for a while before Jesse Nelson quit, image. Ken McKay slash ITV slash Rex slash Shutterstock by Emma Wilson 08 colon 53, November 4th 2021, comments boy band 5 I've are convinced the little mix feud began months before Jesse Nelson left the girl group in December 2020. Sean Conlon, Scott Robinson, and Richie Neville, the three remaining members of the veteran early OO's pop band admitted life in the spotlight has taken its toll on their mental health. Scott, 41, speculated the feud between Perry Edwards, Leanne Pinnock, Jade Thurlwall and ex-member Jesse had been brewing for a while before the 30-year-old pop star announced her shock decision to leave the hugely successful girl band almost one year ago. There's got to have been some in-band fighting for this to happen. Jesse needs to be out of that band for herself and her mental health, he told the Daily Star. Scott said if it was just four women fighting in real life, there wouldn't be that much attention, but unfortunately for Little Mix, their private spat is being played out in public. If this was two girls having a row in a bar, nobody would care. But because it's Little Mix, it's a big deal. He added. The veteran boy band, who had hits such as Everybody Get Up and Got the Feeling in the early noughties, are no stranger to mental health problems affecting their lineup. In 2001, the youngest member of the band Sean suffered a mental breakdown and was notably absent from Five Ives' music video for their single Let's Dance. He was replaced by a cardboard cutout in the video, and he said he wasn't supported despite admitting he was really struggling. Sean admitted he was finding it hard to get my head around all the pressures, but nobody had the sympathy or the compassion we have now. Scott said the band had to carry on filming the music video, despite Sean's absence, and looking back on the incident, he said it was a weird situation. We weren't even allowed to say what had happened, we said he had glandular fever, he added. In December last year, Jessie shocked Little Mix fans around the world when she announced her departure from the band, as she revealed she had been suffering with her mental health. Barry, Leanne and Jade issued a statement shortly afterwards, suggesting the quartet had parted on good terms, as they said it was so important that she does what is right for her mental health and well-being. In August, Jesse spoke with The Guardian newspaper, and revealed that after suffering a panic attack while filming the music video for the girl group's single Sweet Melody, Jesse knew it was time to quit. She said her bandmates also suggested she leave Little Mix, and told Jesse's mother they thought the singer should come out of this now. The girl group have been embroiled in a bitter spat since Jesse announced the release of new debut solo single Boys, and failed to congratulate Perry and Leanne on the birth of their babies over the summer. The rift was further deepened when rapper Nicki Minaj waded into a row over black fishing, after it was alleged Leanne had accused Jesse of appropriating black culture in the video for her solo single. Follow Mirror Facebook Twitter comment.